Hello everyone and welcome back and this will be your general weekly reading for the sign of Aquarius for the week of October 27th and I would like to wish each and every one of you a very safe and happy Halloween as you can see by my table I really enjoy Halloween it's one of my more favorite holidays ever and I would like to give a very special thank you to each and every one of you who have been subscribing to my channel and helping it grow and getting it noticed and sharing with others. And for all the thumbs up on all the videos that you watch. And of course the lovely comments. Thank you so much for doing that for me. It is truly appreciated. card out a page of swords so news coming in no something's not quite right a lot of people not happy with your decisions that you're making this week but you're telling them beware you're making sure that things that are changing are changing the way you want them to change this week in relationships whatever it happens to be you're standing your ground you're fighting fairly but you're fighting to get what it is that you want in your life not always bending to others so beware of that this week and the world card yeah. you've come to a finish line you know you want things to change and you're realizing the only way things are going to change right now is if you make them and that's what you're doing you're determined to make sure things stop going the way they were and start to redirect in a different direction for any uh, many of you this is actually thinking of looking into taking trips abroad maybe places that you've either been before or want to you know go and look at but you haven't taken that venture and now you're taking action on looking into it very seriously and the Emperor very determined this week making sure that you're making really good investments that you don't have to stress and worry in the future you know looking into um, your money is invested in the right places at the right time like blue chips RSPs whatever it happens to be for you and you want to make sure that it's physically going to pay you back that it's not going to be wasted so you're really looking into what is the best place to make the best investments for your future and the four of cups you're content where you're at you know you have enough your cups are full you're enjoying life you're sitting back but you're sort of almost bored a little bit this week you want a little bit more excitement maybe you're just wanting things to change a little faster than what they have and you're trying to pick the next thing that's going to excite you or ignite you again and the four swords yeah maybe you've been taking care of somebody for a while and it's just left you tired and you want to you know this time of year for many it's you know seasonal disorder they call it but you get a little more depressed as the evening goes on because you're thinking too much because there's not so much sunlight so you may want to you know go out and embellish a little bit you know get a massage or you know whatever it is get your hair colored whatever it happens to be that it gives you enjoyment but get out and about a little bit to bring your life back into your body and the death card okay well something has definitely come to a completion in your life and you want now to close the door on it permanently it's taught you a lot it's got you to where you are yes some of the memories aren't always fond and whatever but it has also opened your eyes to many things in your life now so as bad as some of it was 
You're glad that it's over because it's taught you a lot and you're learning to now leave the past in the past and move into the future for yourself. And the wheel. Look at you go. There's money here. There could be some um, unexpected money coming in, like such as a lottery winning. And it is going to allow you to do something that you've wanted to do for a long time. You know, whether that's travel or buy something for yourself, embellish a little bit. This could also be a big career break for some of you. So you get the opportunity to move up the ladder, get more money, make better pay, which in slot gives you a little step up in life a little bit. You can breathe a little bit easier. But there's definitely a career break for the majority of you here. There's money coming in. There's love. You just really in the right place at the right time now for yourself and things are really starting to happen and that ten of swords he's been in just about everybody's reading so far you know something's happened sorry you know somebody's betrayed you you've caught in wind of it it's not nice and it was unexpected you didn't expect that person to have done that or said that. So it's really left a profound mark here on you. But you're realizing that, okay, if that's the way they want to be, then they're over there. They're dead, done, and over with. I'll have nothing more to do with them. I won't talk to them. I won't see them. And boy, when you say something like that, you really mean it. You don't backslide. So you're letting that person go once and for all. You're you know, taking the swords out, standing up, dusting yourself off, and telling them, you know what, <sighs> go away. And the Ten of Pentacles. So you're getting your life in order here. Now this could have been an inheritance that has been given to you, and you're making sure that it's set up for you and yours going into the future that it's not going to have to worry you know it's going to be worth something you're making really good investments this could be money this could have been land a home but it's a legacy to you that you can pass on to yours and you're making sure that it's getting to the right place at the right time so you're taking care of business this week in order to make sure that you are content and happy with what the future is showing you. Ooh, look at the celebration. Three of Cups, definitely celebration. Money coming in, happiness. This could be an uh, invitation for a wedding, a birthday, just a celebration of life in general because you're just content, you know, and you just want to get together unexpectedly. It doesn't have to be any one particular moment but you're being asked to go to this this could be a dinner whatever it happens to be and you're sort of hesitating a little bit not quite sure if you're really feeling that you want to do this but you will and you'll be glad when you do it you know because it'll give you many memories to come in the future so it will make you happy because you're where you're going and being invited to go to you actually get along with these people you know Sometimes not everything's rosy, but right now it's quite happy. And the King of Pentacles. Making investments. Absolutely making right investments for yourself. You want contentment. You don't want to have to worry. You know, you're making sure that your money, what it is that you own or have in your possession, is going to continue to give to yours in the future. You're making sure that all your ducks are in a row this week. Something has showed you that you need to get your life in order. And that's what you're doing. Ooh, two of cups. Very nice. Friendship, happiness, a coming together of a reunion. This could be the rekindling of a union between two people. This could be a friendship as well as, you know, an intimate one as well. But whatever it is, it's somebody that you really click with. You get along with, you laugh together, you have fun together. You're just happy to see one another. And it is going to bring you to a really good place in your mind and your heart. 
Oh, look at that. And the magician shows up. Well, perfect. The potential for your blissful week is right here. You can see it. You can sense it. You can taste it. That's how close it all is. You're getting out from under difficult challenges and you're moving forward in a positive note now. You're very focused in on what it is that you want in your future and you're going for it because you know it's time now. All right, I am going to shuffle and deal you a fairy card. But yours are all about making investments for your future. Finances and, you know, happiness for yourself. Peace of mind. Look to the future with hope and optimism. The power of faith to move mountains. Happy changes that bring relief from challenging times and there it is and on that note i will say goodbye for now don't forget to subscribe to my channel and i will talk to you again next week bye for now